pandemic has been tough on local animal shelters as many try to make sure dogs get adopted in a safe way. Recently, So Humane in Medford was hit with some disappointing news in the midst of all of this. You may remember Argus. He had a bit of trouble getting adopted. He found a home three months ago, but was just recently returned. Being back in the shelter once again is not only heartbreaking to witness, but you can hear Argus's frustration throughout the shelter. Yeah, that's Argus. <laughs> you can hear him from the time I get here in the morning until the volunteers come about lunchtime. He just barks the entire time because he wants out of his kennel and he wants human interaction. Karen Evans, executive director with So Humane, says it's not uncommon to have dogs get returned to the shelter for various reasons. But for Argus, this is becoming a sad way of life. We transferred him here from another shelter uh, back in November. He was here for a week and adopted and returned because there was a dog that was roughhousing with him in the home. Then he was here for a few more months and adopted again, you know, in the home for three months, now returned again. I mean, this is just no life for an animal. Argus was returned because his home was not a good fit. Evan says it appears there was a lot of traffic in the home, including young children. Something the staff at So Humane knew was not ideal for this pup and something they make sure to pass along to potential owners. We want the match to work, so we try to give every possible piece of information we can about an animal. Being returned is even more stressful than being here in the first place. Because the home didn't work out well for him, then that shows us that he's probably better off here again with us and that we will find him a better home. Volunteer Lynn McBee was sad to hear Argus was back and works with him on a daily basis. She says while he's a bit unsure of strangers, he warms up quickly, especially when treats are involved. But sometimes he gets very um, vocal because he wants us in the yard. The change in his stress level is obvious from his kennel. <laughs> to being in a yard with human interaction. And the staff at So Humane worry his time is running short. And at the end of the day, dogs belong in a home, not in a shelter. Argus, again, does not do well with young children, and a quiet, low-key home is probably his best bet. So Humane also says he has a slight pain in his back leg, possibly from a past injury. It's been checked out by a veterinarian, and surgery is not necessary, although supplements like glucosamine are suggested. If you're interested in adopting Argus or any of the animals at So Humane, we've put a link to this story at KTVL.com.